And in today's episode, we have a car that is very chilled in the compact SUV segment. Because of the way it looked and the performance, but after this video, I'm sure you'll be thrilled. Without any waste of time, welcome to the episode of the Fiat 500 Export. The Fiat 500X has a wide range of models to offer, such as the Cult, Fiat 500X Connect, the Cross, the Sport which has a 4-wheel as well as a 2-wheel drive, and a Cabriolet. And the car that we have today is the Sport 2-wheel drive which is driven by a 1.4 4-cylinder turbocharged petrol engine which is shared among the range which produces a maximum power of 103 kilowatts at 5,000 RPM as well as 230 Nm of torque at 250 RPM, which is paired to a 6-speed automatic gearbox which can help the car drive to speeds of up to 190 km per hour and it can drive from 0 to 100 in less than 9.8 seconds. And all the power is directed to its front-wheel drive train which drives on 19-inch sporty wheels on a fuel consumption of 5.7 liters per 100 kilometers which is chowed directly from its 48 liter petrol tank which has an average range of 842 kilometers. And there's one thing that makes this car stand out from its competition since it has sportiness detailed from the exterior as well as the interior. And talking about competitors, we get the Honda HRV. Jeep Renegade, and a corner, as well as the Mazda CX-3. So this car only has two drive modes on offer, the Comfort and Sport, where paddle shifters are also fitted so one can enjoy the sporty experience. So how does one feel safe when driving a sporty Fiat which weighs around 1320 kilograms? And besides the sporty suspension, this car has traction control, EPD, APS, stability control, brake assist, ESP, lane keep assist and can also recognize traffic signs and also has six airbags fitted for both rear and front passengers. On a price tag of 554,900, this is what you get. Electric windows, adjustable multifunctional leather wrapped steering wheel, LED running light, cruise control, rain sensing wipers, air conditioning, as well as the leather wrapped sporty seats which also have red stitching on them which helps enhance the sportiness. And right on your speedometer you have a 3.5 TFT color display and next to it there's a 7 inch infotainment system which supports Apple CarPlay as well as Android Auto, Bluetooth and is connected to 6 speakers. Now let's talk about the finances. And to finance the 554,900 Fiat, one can expect to pay a monthly installment of 9,052 for a period of 72 months on an interest rate of 11%, where there's also a 10% deposit as well as a 10% balloon payment, which are basically 55,490. And all that will take your total loan cost to 651,768. Now let's focus on the cost of ownership. So let's put down 9052 for installment and for insurance let's have 3500 and to fill up our 48 litre petrol tank we'll need around 1090 which brings us to 13642. And for your warranty you are given a 5 year 100,000 kilometre warranty a 3 year 60,000 km service plan as well as a 15,000 km service interval. And like any other episode, this has to mark the end of today's episode. Please don't forget to like, subscribe and also comment down below giving your thoughts about the car. From Car Reviews, I'm signing out. Ciao! And this is what to expect on the next upload.